Hi everyone and welcome back to Prefusion. I'm Anish and I'm back with a job notification. So this time, uh, the Government of India Ministry of Defense, uh, Ministry of Defense, Defense R&D Organization (DRDO) has come up with a job notification. So first, I want to tell you that these are eligible. This notification is eligible for uh, branches from ECE, EE, and CSIT. Okay, if you are if you are not from these branches, then you can leave this video. Also, uh, you have to qualify gate for this. You don't need a particular score. You just have to qualify gate sc score for this, and you will have to give a walk-in interview. There will be not be a written test. You will you can give directly a walk-in interview, and you can get selected. So yeah, these are the in important information. So if you are eligible, then you can uh, watch this video. If you are not, then don't forget to hit the like button so that it can reach the people or students who are eligible for this and they can take benefit from this so first uh, the no notification is about walking interview for selection of 19 junior research fellows so uh, this is contractual so first uh, they are telling you that the candidates would initially be selected for uh, two years of period to work in area of uh, uh, cryptology then after that it can go extend it can get extended to up to five years Okay, so we'll uh, read that later. So for which uh, branches it is eligible? Here we can see mainly like uh, our uh, subscribers are from these two branches. So either you are from CSC, IT or Computer Science or you are from EE or EC. So if you belong to these two, uh, three branches, then you have to have a BE, BTEC degree in uh, Computer Science Engineering, IT, CS with first division and a valid net slash gate score. If you have a valid gate score, if you even have qualified gate, then it is fine. But what do I think is the interview is 15th of March. So obviously the gate result, the 2024 result won't come out. So uh, current uh, gate students who have just given the gate 2024, they are mostly not eligible. Okay. If the result comes before this, then they are. If the if it doesn't come before this, then obviously they are not eligible for this post. Also, if you have some, if you have done your ME intake, ME MTech in the relevant field with uh, first division both at graduate and post graduate level then also you are uh, eligible and you need to have these type of skills like C++, Java, Python all these things you need to learn okay and the interview will happen on 5th of March you don't need to give any written test there will not be any application fee again for EE and EC uh, be BTEC in EEC with first division and a valid net slash gate score or MEM tech in a relevant branch and you have to have uh, like first division in both graduate and the post graduate level now these are the desirable skills that you need to have and the interview date is 18th of march okay so these two are the important branches the monthly stipend that you will get is 37000 plus the hra okay and other facilities so it total a total it comes out to be almost 50000 something more than 50000 okay and also other amenities you will get then uh, like uh, you can read the reporting time and all those things uh, like here they have mentioned that initially you will, be, you will be selected for two years and based on your performance it can get extended up to five years okay and the candidate may allow be allowed to register for a phd he may do his uh, phd simultaneously while uh, doing this uh, training at the drdo okay so you can do do this simultaneously now uh, what things you need what things documents you need proof, proof of letter of birth mark sheets of your educational qualification cash certificates passport site photos and other things okay these things you can read and yeah candidates are not allowed to bring pen drive laptop electric uh, electronic devices camera at the time of interview so you're not allowed any electronic devices at the time of interview so just be careful about that and like here you have to just uh, go to their website and submit this uh, drdo fellowship so the website will be in the link to the website will be given in the description below and you can also join our telegram group for like more information about this drdo application okay you have to submit all this uh, uh, app, like uh, different forms yeah i will see you in the next video thank you for watching